what is that they're trying to show? Because that's uh, evidently that's a message for somebody, either for us or for someone else. Look at that too. It's black, and it has a, 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 a bright tip, like a candle. And there's another one here. And then you see the fingernails. Look. And they say this is a vapor cloud that came out of this uh, venting hole. I think that's an electromagnetic vehicle stuck in the ground, and I don't think so. I think that's just a, a tool that is there permanently. Part of, part of the whole entire deal. That moon, the moon that rotates around Earth is way too big to be a, a, a capture moon. It doesn't fit none of them. It's very light. Uh, it, it, as far as we know, that's a sphere. Look at the fingernail. Look, I'm sorry. I gotta come back and say it again because people don't, just doesn't get it. Look. What do you think dies? And then this one right here, which always has this kind of cut at the back of it. For some reason they do that. But at the end, it's a gigantic ass claw. And you can see it right here, the, the other part of it. Well, you can see these are fingers. It's more medium and large. Look, there's more fingernail right there. There's one right here, there's another one right here. Oh, this is terrible, man. We just don't get it. Well, I get it. People would fight tooth and nail with this. No, 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 you are looking at Paradolia. Yeah, Paradolia every fucking where? Is this Paradolia? Well, how come it's every fucking where? I mean, let's talk rough now. And look what it does. This is a finger on top of that. It's not only one, it's several fingers in a smaller sizes. I mean, it's like they're showing you the same shit over and over. And you don't get it. I, I, I'm yet to find somebody that will argue with me, that will tell me that, no, that's not what will show me what you think it is. If you don't think that's what that is, will you show me what else fits? the pattern. I'm yet to find somebody that will challenge me with, a, with an intelligent argument. I challenge any freaking one to challenge me with an intelligent deal. After I have studied hundreds of thousands, because that is 13 years of research. The freaking Dio used geometry to create these freaking faces. And what are the faces? Some kind of entity with vertical pupils. And what is the motif around the whole thing? Reptiles. So there is some reptilian something that had to do with reptiles. 
Well, think about this. After the dinosaur disappeared, who the hell put all these animals back? Then after the flood, who put animals back? Think about that. Who else? Uh, to be the same people that created this deal and why they got rid of them because this they were no good for the the for their experiment, whatever. This is like an experiment. This thing is either a toe, I think this is a toe, a, a foot right here. I can see the outlines of I might be wrong, but they are in straight line. This is a different picture, this one right here. It's just to show the, the, the shit that was there, but this this picture has meaning beyond just what you see in there. There is a scenery here of some guy standing around and doing something, and there is there's a scenery there. Now let's look at this one. Oh, this one is freaky. Look at a hen. Look at that. These are hens. This is a freaking hen holding a cylinder. Once again. Look how it curls the, the, the tongue or the, the pinky. Look, it curls all the way. It's a straight and it's curled. See how it curls right here? That's the index. I mean, it's so perfectly made that it is no doubt that's what that is. And he's holding this thing right here. Whatever this thing is, this is what is holding that shit. The hand is holding this cylindrical whatever. Look, first the hand curled this way. Uh, it, it, it's several, it's like two or three hands in different ways. Now I finally got it, that's what those are, hands. And then look, you can see this structure underneath. Just look at that, not a single star visible anywhere, just like a white safe from the Gemini 4. No one single entity, I mean, a star is there. You tell me, where are the planets? Where the fuck is everything else? Nothing, no star. And they don't point the camera towards the sun. The sun is not visible, it's probably a black shit. It will burn the shit out of your camera because it's a photonic deal. But uh, they never pointed the camera to the sun, never. They have filters and all kinds of shit. Well, well there's fil uh, lenses like the, the one they use for welding. I am very sure that NASA had those filters. Think about it. People don't think. That's the problem, that we are so stupid eyes that we don't think what, what is in the shadow. Look, that's a freaking hand curl dog. Look, right there, that is a freaking hand curl dog. Perfectly made, look. That's the other finger. And you can see the fingernail 
shiny look. There is another fingernail. I finally decode this image. It's the same freaking thing, look. And it goes into the larger scale, the same thing. Larger and larger, and it's just, that's what that is. All bunch of hands, like that. And they made the same scenery. A hand, curled off hand, holding, whatever. I mean, they made it so perfect that the crispy images, that's why NASA doesn't show a damn thing. Now I got finally the message why they don't show this. And why they made a deal with this entity, not this entity, the other one, reptilians. Because they know, they find out that this is what that is. Uh, we live in a structure controlled by these entities, which are not really the right one. The Elohim is the, these are the Yahweh, the reptilian looking badasses. And there's other entities coming in here, but it's all uh, at the, you know, the technology, man. And, and, and this is at a conscious level, too. That, that entity that Leonard Watson captured with his telescope inside that structure, that entity that must be thousands and thousands of miles large. Oh, is the structure that he's sitting in is the size of the sun. Just think about it. That's why they fly, they start flying helicopters to to harass Leonard Watson in his house because he was recording that shit every night. In fact, during the day, he could see it about five in the afternoon. He could, uh, he, I bought the DVD that Jose Camilla names in, in Interstellar. But he didn't post that image of the creature, of the creature, you know, the being. We might be the creatures, the little goats and, and the sheep. But we are sheep. Well, look, there's not a single star, and this shit is only part of the structure. That black, dark structure. And like I say, all this shit is fingers and fingernails, and it's in every freaking image. In every image. This is a Russian image. Uh, no, that's not an American Apollo shit. This is from the Luna series, from the Russians. Look at that. Look at that. That's the, the, not a single star. That's another part of the, of the, what is visible is there the same thing, fingernail. Look, there's a finger right there. Clearly, look at the lines. Look at the outline of fingers. Some are, they, I mean, they become bigger and bigger and bigger. They, these people are, oh, I don't know if they're an obsession with that shit. Or, but look, these are all a bunch of fingers. One, two, three, four, five. Right there, you can see it clearly. I mean, I know, I'm not making this up. You're looking at the same thing I am. But it makes an eye, you know. It looks like a foot. That looked like a foot, no, not a hand, but a foot.